Hello, and welcome. We're back at the uh, scientist place here, because the next thing on our list is this X-18. It also says disable the miracle machine. What? Get down. What do you want? What's your problem? Have some shotgun shells. You got a decent bit of money. Take all of those. Offload some of those at him and that. Oh well, he's got a bunch of crap on him. I will take that. No point in taking the energy drinks, I got plenty of those actually. Will you buy anything off of me? Grenade, grenade, bread, some sausage rolls. So, I slept till, uh, 7 a.m. inside the bunker, and now our goal is to get in there, to this zombie-infested wasteland. I believe I actually have to go up around the side. Wow, that is a lot of anomalies. The other problem is there's these stupid things that are keep walking at me. My weight is... oh, it's okay actually right now. Quit waving that popcorn at me. Give me some health regen. I gotta be real careful because I don't know if you can see, but there's a giant psychic anomaly there. And I'm actively trying to avoid. Is this a door? It's really annoying needing to keep avoiding these while trying to find a way into here. How do I get in? Let's try stairs. Oh. Yep, stairs. There we go. This looks promising. I thought it looked promising. Ooh, it still looks promising. Nice. I found the entrance to Lab X18? 16? What number am I in anymore? Whoop. 
Why is it like muting my sound out? Oh no. He still hit me. That's bullshit. I'm gonna assume the elevator doesn't work. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That took far more bullets than it should have because I suck at aiming. Oh, they all have health packs and med. med things. I haven't checked my armor. Armor's okay for now. serious right now. Okay, fine. Good man, you made it. After all, extremely important, we start the machine in the lab, try turning it off so we can have a look at it. Stop. Stop. stuff from this from them this time let's try to use ladders properly this time How am I not dying right now? body flew through me. I was like, what, what just happened? Not a fun place to be. I'm not going to screw around with trying to salvage the weapon mods right now. I don't like that sound. Urgh. I should have taken my warning.
who can play that game? Jerk. Got time for your sheet. Oh. I missed. That's fine. Running, 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 running. what that was. It was some sort of armor. Nice. Nice. I'm gonna keep what I'm wearing at the moment. Not because it's not better, but because I feel safer in my current attire. Plus, standing still does not sound like a good idea to me. Nice. If this is so important, why didn't you explain what you are going there for? And where did... where did you get this photo from? If you only knew where I've just been and what I saw... One day you'll finish badly, Strela. <laughs> Don, son. You're going to make it. <laughs> Where will you go now? To the north. the north, he says. To be fair, when you consider what year this made in, was made in, the CGI is actually pretty good. Because remember, th these ones come from Shadow of Chernobyl, which was the first game. That's where the arrow says to go. There's a valid point. I need to actually go back through and click all the zombie corpses for stash and money. Thank you. 
I'll take that one though. That one's for the gun I'm actually using. So now those stupid illusiony things are gone. By the way, one of the achievements, I believe, is for losing, losing, looting a hundred stashes, and it makes future stashes, st stashes, stashes, contain better stuff. It's random. Almost as random as all these guns I have. Whoops. Explains why I'm so overweight. I'm sure there's a reason why I had all those guns on me. I don't know what it is, but I'm sure there's a reason. Body is badly decayed. Okay, so it's been too long since I exploded them. Whatever. Scope, unload, move to there. Accidentally picked that up. This is body armor. This item comprises military PS5 series body armor with beryllium sputter modified for use in the zone. Designed for assault operations in highly radioactive areas, it is ineffective in areas of high anomalous activity. The suit makes its way to stalkers through the military who exchange it for loot. Does not come with an artifact container. It does not come with one, it does not say it cannot be upgraded to have one. These are two very important differences. What? That was all kinds of odd. back up this way, can I? Hey, wait, what are you? Oh. Huh. No, I just realized I can't actually go back up this way. That's fine. I still wanted to access all the bodies. get lost so easily. Really? This way. This way. This way. Through the back of these because I can. Stamina regen some. Running, running, running.
Oh, I can't run anymore. You know what? I don't really need a sleeping bag on me. I mean, it doesn't help that I have this 11 kilogram armor on me. loud. Seriously, that is so loud. This guy looks like about on my way out now. This is the body of, uh, Fang? Uh, these documents refer to one of the side discoveries of bio-research, specifically a discovery that living creatures are able to de generate directed psi emissions. A biological field emitter, essentially a giant brain, was grown as part of the research conducted in the lab. Unless it's just a sunrise bodysuit. Huh. And that concludes investigating the lab. No idea where this is going to take me out. But I believe it's going to spit me out into the zone to the north, maybe? Well, that looks to be the research compound there. You bastards. Poke your head up again, I dare you. I can't be bothered to deal with you and I'm dropping weight at the same time. This is pretty fun, I usually don't use grenade launchers in games. going to talk about the glitchiness that is. <laughs> oh god, it was only a matter of time until I did that. <laughs> oh god. so I can see a little bit clearer. <laughs> well, that just looks downright unpleasant. In fact, this looks extremely unpleasant.
bandage it necessary? No, not really. Okay. I get it. I'm in tunnels. I did not need to do that. Oh, PDA. <laughs> Two for one deal. Hmm. Should stop burning through those now. I've never been so glad to have a grenade launcher around in my life. Ooh, scientific mag. Where am I going? Oh, wait. Looks like I might almost be out. See a ladder. Is it the ladder to freedom or the ladder to sadness? that again. Freedom! Well, you know what they say. Third time's the charm. Freedom! Great work. The mission has been turned up and you're still alive. Oh, by the way. Oh, and by the way, pop into our bunker every once in a while, won't you? Coming over there now. that stash hello How they seem to have developed man? a case of the hiccups animal parts on the random topic of animal parts, one of the achievements actually makes it so you get more, like, animal parts. So that's helpful. I don't know if I would ever use two of them. Maybe I would, actually. If I could get four artifact slots. So, by the way, these are here. I've considered getting this, and even this. Two of them put together are almost as heavy as this by itself. Uh, this has these extra things, but I could actually just sell it and replace it entirely with this. And it says it comes with built-in artifact containers. You know what? I'm going to buy both of them. Uh, do I really want to sell that? I'm gonna do it. Boom. Yeah, it's got two artifact containers. So that allows me to do stuff like put one of these and one of these. 
And now I have... Wait, where's my armor? There's armor. Doesn't it increase armor? It says armor. Oh, explosion armor. Fair enough. Or it could even dump other things into it, like snowflake. It was nice. I'll have to upgrade it and the other chest piece, but I'm gonna go get that stash, and then I'm going to duty territory. So that's it's all pretty well and good there. I really just want to pop this. This is like the cheatiest of drinks, but it's probably excessively rare. Hmm. Not a bad looking uh, camera view. I'm a bit annoyed with how much this gun's all up in my face. I'm actually gonna turn that down. So that that moves the guns a little bit more out of my face and makes it actually a bit more realistic to me that shooting would shoot in the center of my screen. Just look at that. It actually sort of feels like it's aimed at. That said, it also moves the gun to a more of like counter strike distance, to be honest. Artifacts. Are there any artifacts? Now let us brush the wall. There's at least one, possibly two or three. Why am I not showing up on the map? Oh, okay, I see where I am. Here's a fun fact. Does this actually protect me? Please no. Yeah, I didn't think so, which means I'm going to have to try really hard to get back out. There we go. That was actually harder than it should have been. I'm going to assume there's no way out up here, but there might be. Although it doesn't look like it. Jerk. Nope. That said, the anomaly outside has an artifact in it. So that's fun. I actually kind of like how off my screen the, uh, do I have any vodka? No. I was going to say, if I have any vodka, I'll drink them. A vodka to give me a slow reduction. What is this? Battery. Energy recovery radiation. Alright. Oops. There we go. So, Snowflake's just a stronger version of that then? Yeah, that's like tier 3. If you look at artifacts as tiers, of course. Oh yeah, I looted it out of a box. That's... That's how I got it. Pushing it over again, but I'm getting distracted by artifacts with my garbage detector.
Where'd he go? Whatever. Hmm. 5,000 rubles. I'm assuming I vendor it and it becomes 5,000 rubles. Interesting. I was unaware of that. Basically, the thing just said that uh, electronic transactions are used for much of the things in the zone. But stalkers like to keep a few extra coins on them in order to. Is that military? No. Okay. Uh. Stalkers like to keep a few extra coins on them in case of like buying packs of cigarettes or something, and they don't. It conserves battery life to not have to deal with it that way. So that actually gives good reason why there would be, you know, amounts of rubles on the different bandits and stuff. It's just whatever they decided was a good idea to carry with them. It's good. I got enough of these. Consume one to make that crap go away. So I have these documents, and they're clearly quest items, but what what am I planning to do with them? Another reason I'm overweight and I'm not losing stamina because this thing's insane. Because, I mean, look at what this gives. Plus 10. Oh, hey there. 2800, huh? Nope. Do you have anything I'm interested in? that. Cool. Wow. They're worth quite a lot when it comes to buying them. Hercules? Hercules, Hercules. Bam. Job done. How do you some Hercules now. Really? Yeah, now that I know that these are explosion resist, I don't think I really like them. I think I'm gonna sell them. I could have sold them to the scientist, I think, but meh, sell it at the duty bar. Speaking of which, uh, was these two stashes? If I pop a Hercules and energy thing, I can get here, through here pretty quick. I want to actually record whatever's in the stashes, even though it's probably awful. Actually, that's a good question. Are they just listed as personal stashes? Yeah. Yeah, screw it. I'll just loot them. If there's anything interesting, I'll let you know. I'm going to go upgrade these armors, sell a bunch of crap, then, yeah. But for now, I'm going to call this good, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.